We had a little bit of a delay. Yeah. Hi ladies, I'm Tara. And I'm Tyra. And I'm going to be showing you how to do a pouty lip today. And I'm just here to be moral support. <laughs> My first live ever, so she's here to, to help me out a little bit, I guess. Yeah. So, we are going to start with pouty lip liner. And going to line the outside of our lips and the corners into the middle. Can I use that mirror? Yep. Awesome. You sure can. I'm blind. You look like oh, yeah, I forgot. About that. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I can't see even with these things on. Does that look all right? Mm hmm. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so she's starting in the inner corner there. Or, I'm sorry, the at the peak you kind of make almost like an X when you do when you do that <clears throat> and that helps you keep it even on each side and she's going just a little below or above the her natural lip line to give it a fuller effect <clears throat> and then you want to make sure to go all the way to the corners go into the corners so that that connects and it's not um, Missing a spot there. Hey, Tara. Hi, Tara. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, and I'm gonna fill hey, in. Terry. Hi, mom. I'm gonna fill in with the liner and leave this middle open with the lip liner. Just gonna create a um, pouty, fuller. I think now they're calling it ombre uh, lip look. And this will help your lipstick stay on even longer than it does to in general with. anyhow. Right, yeah. right. All right. Now I'm going to take our pristine eyeliner, actually, yeah. and put it right here in the middle. And again, that light, by doing this, she's lightening up that center. And as you heard me talk before um, about highlighting, anytime you put something light, it's going to draw it out and the dark pulls it back. Um, so by her putting that in the center, um, it helps draw the center of her lips forward. Um, I'm just going to pat it. And a little more on this side. Here? Yeah, to make it even. Or had you even done that side yet? And again, there are no rules in makeup. You do what, uh, what makes you feel beautiful. And if you love it, yep. Okay. And then I'm going to use, it's last month's Kudos lipstick. It's sitting pretty. On top. I'm gonna rub that in a little better. And even though um, the Kudos bundle, um, the Start Defending bundle is gone, um, in that bundle was that lipstick, um, this Splurge Cream Eyeshadow and Hopeful. Um, there was an eyeliner that's almost like a eggplant shade and it was gorgeous. Um, and then you also got the Defend Innocence bracelet. Even though that bundle's gone, you can still get these colors today individually. <laughs> I think I overdid the white there a little bit. No, by the time you take it and blend it out, you'll be in good shape. Let me see. Looks good. Good. Powdery lips. And you can top it off with some lip gloss if you like for some extra shine. Yes, and when you're doing an ombre look, if you just put the lip gloss there in the center, just like you did with the um, white liner, uh, that also helps make that pop right. right there in the center. You can also use our eyeshadows. This yep. is the Splurge Cream and Hopeful. You can just put a little bit of that. 
on there. And you can also use the pigments too, just like Tara said. Um, the eye pigment, Sexy, is a really good one. Look at that. That's pretty. Pretty, pretty. Okay. Can you show them our lip stain? Yep, or no, show them this first. Oh, alright. Unique has come out with a new liquid splash lipstick that I'm getting to try for the first time right here. So excited. <laughs> so I'm going to just wipe this off a little bit and um, put this on and show you, show you what it looks like. This is... Uh, sen sentimental, I think. I can't read it. I think it's sentimental, yeah. I'm trying to leave my liner on because it goes real well with that. Tiffany, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for your support. You know I had never been live before. I think I shared that with you. <laughs> and she's doing great. <laughs> doing great. Yep. I'm blind as a bat. I love this already. <laughs> Doesn't it feel good? Uh -huh. It's so, it's like a powdery. I, I like can't explain it. Velvet, it's almost like a velvet feel. Yeah, it's thicker than our lip stain, but it's not like our lipstick. And you get the coverage of a lip stain, coverage and wear, I'm sorry, of our lip stain in this liquid lipstick. It's amazing. <clears throat> yeah, we're our, um, our lip stain is almost like a liquid, almost like water, yeah. really. Um, this is, is thicker. Here, I'm going to do it's, this. It's amazing. Can you see that? It's kind of like thick, almost like a, um, I'm trying to think of some kind of like writing utensil. I know, I can't. I, I always have a hard time trying to figure out how to describe a feeling. Right. And then I'll show you our how our lip stain is on my hand compared to this lipstick, which I love them both. I oh, love yeah. the lip stain. It, you put it on, let it dry, put it on again, let it dry, put it on again if you want and let it dry, yeah. but it stays on all day. Um, and here's our lip stain. And you it is. You can kind of tell it's, it's a lot it's thinner. It's very thin um, liquid. Over here's the liquid lipstick and over here's the lip stain. All right. Oh, I was going to show the lip bonbons. Yeah, the bonbons. Lip bonbons. A lot bigger than the normal chapstick that everybody's used to. They come in yummy flavors. There's <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there's like what And they really do taste good. Yeah. Um there's the raspberry cheesecake, which is this one. And then that one, let me see what what it says on the bottom. You probably can't read I it. I can't read it. I can't even read it. <laughs> what the heck? I don't know. Oh. Chocolate. Truffle. Chocolate truffle. <laughs> I, couldn't, <laughs> I couldn't see it either. Good night. And they are so mm. yummy. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> And creamy and so high in moisture. I mean, y'all, it's... And look, I haven't hardly used the, the chocolate truffle. But, I mean, look how much product you get. This is almost new. I've used it a couple of different times. I've used the heck out of this one. This one's my favorite. Um, so you get a ton of it. And they're yummy. For sure. <clears throat> Thank you. You're welcome. That liquid lipstick looks good on you. I like it. Yeah. There's a a blue. Did you see me talking about that the other day? That's coming out on the 15th is when these actually launch. It's September 15th. Yep. And they we have a blue color, which I'm really actually excited about because 
like Colts blue, you know, right. wouldn't it be yes. fun? I think it'd be fun. Yeah, and then the purple, well, I'm a little nervous about that color, but I'm going to try it. I'll try it. There's a whole bunch, like, <laughs> I think we have like 10, 7, 8, 9, I think I've got a book here. Let me just tell you how many new um, splash liquid lipsticks we have coming. And I really wish I could explain to you guys how the liquid lipstick feels. It's unexplainable. It's awesome. Ten shades. Ten shades. Look at that. Colts blue, baby. Who who is uh, Colts fans here? That's gonna be perfect for you guys. Um, let me see if they. It, it says creamy opaque collar with a water resistant matte finish. So you'll just have to try it. It is. It, you can't. <laughs> you can't explain it. I mean, it, it's to me. It almost feels ve uh, velvety. Right. Yeah. It's very smooth. Feels good on your lips. So, so you guys watch for that. They all launch on the fifteenth, and then of course we have tons of lipsticks and lip different shades of stains and different glosses. Yeah. There's lovesick. Lux. Lux is a great neutral. This is my favorite. I use it all the time. It's like a, a the perfect um, the perfect nude. Lucky. That's one of my favorites. Lovable. Lovable. I like that. I like that pink. Yeah. Ladylike. I think Tyra has just about all of them. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> <laughs> Lethal. Oh, yeah. That's that red. One. I like that. <laughs> Make you lethal. You, yes. you, you wear that on days that you feel lethal. That should be like everybody's warning. Yes. She's got that lip gloss on. <laughs> Stay away. <laughs> yep, watch out. Don't go there today. <laughs> oh, I love it. And then um, the lip stains are kind of hard. They all almost look alike, really, in the tubes. But... Um, I mean, we've got Shy, which... That's what is, I have on here. Yeah, is that. And then, um, I have two Shy's. Uh, my favorite is, let's see, that's Sultry. What's the other? Um, sleek. Sleek. See, it's missing its sticker on the bottom. I have Sleek. Oh, that's I my favorite. I think my daughter It's it. almost like a reddish brown neutral. So it, it doesn't, if you're like me and afraid to try red, um, <laughs> that's a good happy medium. You get a little bit of red with it, with the brown. So, so yep, there's all kinds of awesome, awesome lip products. Oh, and the new exfoliator that's coming out. Yes. Perfect for the lip stains because you want to exfoliate your lips and get the dry and, and stuff off your lips before you put on the lip stain. It just helps it. Can you go <laughs> just helps it apply a lot easier and, and a lot smoother. So that comes out on the 15th as well. Yep, comes yep. out on the 15th. And I guess it's a, a sugar base. And sh see, sugar is a natural exfoliant. Um, and from what I saw um, on a training video from our makeup artist, you just like uh, put it on and then it they have it flavored, and then mm. you lick it right back off. <laughs> nice. <laughs> right? <laughs> so, yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. I'm excited about that because... I am too. This whole time that we've been using lip scrubs, we've been having mm -hmm. to, you know, use a toothbrush or with your wash rag or whatever to try yep. to make sure you exfoliate because that's a must. Your lip stain, if you don't exfoliate first, the lip stain will come off within a couple of hours. Um, I've noticed too because I have put it on without exfoliating my lips. And it don't go on. I mean, you see every little. Yep. Yeah, it just don't look. Because good. the dead. <laughs> what happens is dead skin absorbs stuff quicker, just like with our um, our uh, tanning self tanners. Yep. If you ha if you don't exfoliate, the all of the color pigment goes directly to the dead skin cells because it absorbs it m more than your live skin cells does. So that's why. Awesome. Yep. Very good. Anything else? don't think so. Okay. Have a great evening. Thank you guys. We have more um, lives coming up, more um, 
tutorials all the way up until after nine o'clock tonight. So stay tuned with us and um, have fun. Bye ladies. Bye.